Hi, I'm John Lin, Production Automation Manager for the California Strawberry Commission and the Cal Poly Strawberry Center. Here at the center, we work together with students, faculty and staff, and the Commission's field team to both create and validate technologies for California strawberry growers. Today we will focus on three pieces of field equipment, the Ligus bug vacuum, the spray rig, and the plastic mulch cross hole puncher. To tell you more, here is Jack Wells and Caleb Fink. Hi, I'm Jack Wells. I'm a Cal Poly alum, and now I'm the California Strawberry Commission's production automation engineer. Today, I'll be walking you through the new Lagus Bug vacuum improvements. First, here's a little background. The Lagus Bug is the most economically damaging pest in California strawberries, costing growers an estimated one to $200 million in decreased fruit yields per year. The bugs feed on the seeds of developing strawberries, causing damage commonly known as cat facing. The majority of the industry uses bug vacuums to manage this pest. A bug vacuum is a tractor mounted implement and typically covers three strawberry beds at a time. Each bed is covered by a single fan and hood assembly. The fans pull high velocity air through the plant canopy, which sucks lagus bugs off the plants and into a steel baffle located atop the vacuum's exhaust. The California Strawberry Commission's automation team began the Lycus Bug Vacuum Optimization Project in 2017. The primary goal was to increase the vacuum's total airflow. As such, the conventional narrow ducting was discarded in favor of a straight tube design. The straight tube design causes the fans to run more efficiently and therefore better utilizes the power available from the tractor. For vacuums used on 64-inch beds, the same tractor can now power two fans per bed instead of one which more than doubles the inlet area while maintaining the required airspeed. Modifications to the vacuum exhaust further increase performance. Six inch risers were added between the top of the duct and the steel baffles. This allows much of the air that flows through the vacuum to escape around the sides rather than being forced through the baffles themselves. This escape route increased wind speeds at the inlet by 20%. Although the air now escapes out the sides, the momentum of the lagus bug maintains an upward trajectory until it slams into the perforated baffles. Studies indicated that only 2% of the lagus bugs survived the trip through the vacuum. The result of this work is the new double barrel bug vacuum, which has been evaluated to remove an average of 2.3 times more lagus bugs per pass than conventional vacuums. The new vacuum is available for purchase from CNN Tractors in Watsonville and Paso Robles, California. In addition, fabrication drawings and component listings are available online by navigating to the automation tab on calstrawberry.com. The work discussed thus far has been on 64 inch bed vacuums, typical of the Santa Maria and Oxnard growing districts. Recommendation for the smaller two row beds found in the Watsonville and Salinas areas will be provided late 2020.